Toys are supposed to be fun, but for kids with disabilities, playing with them isn't always possible. Valley News Team's Jordan Redmond shows us how a group of engineering students at NDSU are working to change that this holiday season. <laughs> NDSU's electrical and computer engineering building felt more like Santa's workshop than a classroom today. I get to feel like a little bit like Santa's elf and making toys right before Christmas and get distributed and I think that's a really neat part of this event. Soldering, rewiring, and modifying. This group of engineering students are using their talent to make adaptive toys for children of all abilities. These kids, you know, everybody deserves a chance to be able to play with the toy they want to on Christmas and during the holidays. And being able to adapt these toys for people of all abilities, I think, is really, really important and really special. Um, putting bigger buttons on some toys, or even making the ones they have easier to press, to bring the joy they're made to give. Three, two, one, go. Most important part, I think, is uh, knowing the fact that they're going to children. This is the fifth year of the program, part of the annual Toy Adaptathon, and these students are working on ten toys to give. More coming in next week, though. So all of them are donated from families in the community who are in need, or families who just wanted to donate these toys. And all of the students with the same mission. The main goal is be able to just bring the joy that these toys can bring to kids and just be able to make that accessible for everybody. Reporting in Fargo, this is awesome. Jordan Redmond, Valley News Live. I guess it doesn't really matter. Now that is pretty impressive. They're still taking donations if you're willing and able until next Wednesday. You can find out how to do that by heading to our website or your free VNL News app. Just click on this story.